The tenth today we review will be the Valentine's Day edition. So today we watched uh, Case of You. It's a 2013 film. It's a comedy romance and it's rated R. On IMDb it has a 5.6. The film is directed by Kat Coyle. She also directed Life Happens and While We Were Here, uh, 2011 and 2012. So the film, a young writer tries to impress a girl that he met online by being everything that she likes on Facebook. The movie is like Catfish, but if it was a comedy. If you've not seen Catfish, you should definitely check that movie out. The film has uh, Justin Long in it. He's the young writer. His name is Sam in this. He falls for Birdie. She is the barista at his local coffee shop. Birdie is played by Evan Rachel Wood. At the coffee shop also, uh, Peter Dinklage is there. Peter Dinklage from Game of Thrones. And uh, in this, he's hilarious and he's really flamboyant. And it's a great job done by Peter Dinklage in this. Keir O'Donnell is also in this. He plays Elliot, who is Sam's roommate. There are some funny instances between Sam and Elliot, uh, particularly when Sam walks in on Elliot. He still looks at Leia, but in the present day Carrie Fisher, he doesn't look at the Star Wars one because he says he's not a child. Vince Vaughn is also in this. He plays uh, Justin's book agent. He reminds me a lot of Tom Cruise's character in Jerry Maguire. Sam Rockwell shows up. He's a guitar teacher who uh, says he played at Woodstock. There's a rant that he has with Sam over not knowing who Chris Barron is. I guess that was someone from the Spin Doctors. I don't know who it is either. Sorry, Sam. Um, and then there's parts where he talks about G-Spot and G-Chords. You also get to hear Rockwell sing. The film's just riddled with people that you uh, recognize. Uh, there's also Scott Adsit, who plays the uh, announcer when they're at the ballroom dancing. And he, he's there for such a short time, but he is very good at being a... Uh, the character that just shows up for a second, does his line, delivers it great, and then uh, isn't there. But I do like seeing him in films. Brendan Fraser is also in this. He plays uh, Tony, who is Bertie's ex. He reminds me of a lot of uh, the character from his film Airheads. It's, it's really good. Um, it didn't really make sense to me that he would have been dating Bertie, but whatever. I don't usually watch romantic movies just because I don't find them enjoyable. but. I do enjoy it. Justin Long films, pretty much anything he does I'll watch, except it's great. His performance in Zack and Mary Make a Porno was awesome. So I saw Justin Long was in this, so I figured I'd give it a shot, and I was surprised. The movie is like Catfish, but on a comedic level, and if Catfish worked out, I like the film. It doesn't try to be something that it's not. So a Case of You is a keep. I am kind of surprised to say that, but I enjoyed it a lot, and I'll probably watch it again. And uh, if you haven't seen A Case of You and you're looking for something to watch today, i got to watch Camp Dakota later and House of Cards, of course. But this is a good film to see. So thanks for watching the 10th Today We Review. Uh, coming up, there definitely will be a Today We Review on Camp Dakota. If you don't know what that is, I'll put a link in the description below. Grace Helbig, Hannah Hart. And to get information on future Today We Reviews and have a hand in picking the films, you can follow me at MadLFan on Twitter. You can follow me on Facebook, link below. Use hashtag today we review on Facebook or Twitter, and I'll find it. You can comment down below with uh, future suggestions. Thanks for watching. You're a good girl.